and carry you to the grave. Hello. I'll be your counsellor over the next few weeks. Uh-huh. My name is Melanie. Uh-huh. <laughs> Melanie. Uh-huh. You mean like melon? Uh-huh. You people in this country have very fruity names. Uh-huh. There is Anna Banana, uh-huh. Sherry, and Peaches. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Is your sister called Satsuma? <laughs> How are you, Mr. and Mrs. Om Yes. Sorry, sorry. So, um, let's start with you. How are you feeling? Will you just shut up and let me answer? Uh, did you see my lips moving? Eh? Mm. Or are you calling me ventriloquist? <laughs> Let's leave the negativity outside the room. Will you not interrupt me when I am arguing with my wife? You are not arguing with me. I am arguing with you. Stop it. eh? Or you want to pluck me like a chicken? Papa? Stop watching us. Look at where you are a pervert. It says here uh, that you have another husband. How are things with him? Uh, well, he's not very exciting mm. or alive in the bedroom. You mean he's impotent? No, I mean he's dead. <laughs> and he's still in my house. I want the remover people to get him out. Why should he be removed? He's still my husband. Yes, and you are my wife. Hmm? And I am still alive, but I am sharing my wife and bed with a dead man. <laughs> so I, I see you're um, experimenting with new activities in the bedroom. Okay, what have you tried? Cleaning. <laughs> I mean activities of a sexual nature, like blindfolding. Oh, yes. <laughs> uh, yes, he blindfolded me. Then he pushed me out into the road. Is it my fault there is no zebra crossing there? Well, have you thought about dressing up? Uh-uh. As what? <laughs> well, well, as whatever the other person might like. Well, she likes goats, but I'm afraid to dress up like a sacrificial animal. Because she will slit my throat. I think that's true. Are you calling my husband a liar? How dare you? In my country, I would have flogged you by now. Okay, okay I think this is a good place to end today's session. Uh, you, do you have husband? I've got a boyfriend. Ah, boyfriend. So he's not ready to become your husband yet? No. <laughs> is he ready to become mine? <laughs> uh, what of yourself? Because you are very masculine. That's right. <laughs> I'm very open-minded. Mm-hmm. <laughs>